अनेक चित्त विभ्रांता मोहजाल समावृता प्रसक्त काम भोगेशु पतंती नरके अशुचौ हेलो फ्रेंड्स फ्रेंड्स दिस इज दी सिक्सटींथ श्लोक ऑफ दी सिक्सटींथ चैप्टर ऑफ भगवदगीता एंड टुडे वी विल अंडरस्टैंड दिस इज श्लोक इन डिटेल सो लेट्स फर्स्ट गोर इट्स मीनिंग सो द श्लोक सेज अनेक चित्त विभ्रांता विच मीन्स कैरिंग मेनी वॉन्डरिंग्स इन दी माइंड मोहजाल समावृता विच मीन्स कवर्ड इन अ वेब ऑफ डिल्यूजन फ्रॉम ऑल साइड्स प्रसक्त काम भोगेशु विच मीन्स अटैच्ड टू दी प्लेजर्स ऑफ डिजायर पतंती नरके अशुचौ विच मीन्स फॉल इन हेल दी इम प्योर सो हेयर श्री कृष्णा मैंशन दैट दी डिमोनिक पीपल कैरी मैनी वॉन्डरिंग्स इन देयर माइंड एंड देयर फॉर दे बिकम कवर्ड इन दी वेब ऑफ डिल्यूजन एंड दिस वेब ऑफ डिल्यूजन बेसिकली कवर्स दैम फ्रॉम ऑल साइड सो दे आर नॉट रियली एबल टू see the truth very clearly so by getting attached to their impure desires which are sprouting from ignorance then they fall into hell so while living our lives in this world uh, we engage in many activities and all of these activities basically required some sort of an engagement of our mind now by practicing the mental engagement or you can say these mental activities over many lifetimes our mind has become a factory of thoughts and uh, there are thousands of thoughts that come to our mind in a day so the quality of the thoughts that come to our mind basically determine the quality of our life so it's very important that uh, we cultivate right kind of thoughts in our mind so if a person remains anchored only to the divine thoughts then he or she can attain divinity but uh, only entertaining such divine thoughts in the mind requires a lot of discipline and therefore it is not easy most people actually are quite lazy and they entertain whatever thought that comes in their mind and then they just basically keep delving on that negative thought so throughout many lifetimes by cultivating such inferior negative thoughts the demonic people have become covered in a web of delusion from all sides they basically are not able to see the truth correctly because they have got colored by the wrong thoughts so since the thinking is deluded by their desire they have become impure and so they are inspired by untruths all their actions basically are inspired by untruths and by pursuing such wrong desires based on untruths the demonic people they fall in hell and suffer their actions are not really of good quality and the consequences of their actions therefore again are uh, very bad and so they basically fall in hell and suffer all the time so that is what shri krishna is saying over here i hope that i have explained this shlok well to you with that i'll close this video i'll see you in the next video take care